hi guys welcome back to my channel civil inch ts so this is the second video of the series of the plot setting in this video i will explain about the ctb file how we can create the ctb file and what the changes we can do in the ctb file let me open the autocad this is the layout of a building drawing and i draw some additional lines in the different colors for better explanation and show the clear changes of the plot setting. I will explain the ctb file. Control P. If you guys can see here the plot style table is none. So once we click on preview we can see the original colors of the drawing and everything is the same as we can see in the layout. Mean to say the print preview and the layout of the drawing is the same exact here we have some default ctb file i will explain two the first one is acad.ctb click here preview it is the normal ctb file it is the same like a layout we can do changes inside in this ctb file as well but i am not doing that now the second ctb file is monochrome this one is the famous ctb file once we click the monochrome and then click the preview you guys can see even our layout is colorful but the print preview is black and white so this is one of the major uh, function of the ctb file so I have to explain these two types and different properties inside of this ctb file. But I will create the new one same as like this. So let me bring back to the none, apply, cancel. In order to create the new ctb file, the first step is I have to open the ctb file location. So for that I have to click on menu, print manage plot style click on this here we have different type of plotting styles and we have two different extensions ctb and stb of the plotting styles first i am creating the new ctb file here you guys can see if you look at here add a plot style table wizard this is a exe file but if you want to create the new ctb file for that you have to double click on this add a plot style table once you double click on it this window will pop up i have to click next we have some option here the first one is start from scratch okay the second one is use an existing plot style table so I am selecting the first one next I will explain the second one okay next here I have two option first of all I have to click this one color dependent plot style table name plot style table first I am explaining color dependent plot style table so click on next here I am giving the name of the ctb file for example I am giving the name building hit next so before click on finish plot style table editor now this is the area where we can edit the plot style table now i am not doing anything here this is the creation first i am creating the normal ctb file so i will create first this one then i will edit with the example save finish finish once you click finish building ctb file this one is the new ctb file which we created if you want to do any changes in this double click you can do changes from here also and we can do the changes from here also next use an existing plot style table next and from here we can change the things now i am opening the layout control p you guys can see the building ctb file is here click on it apply preview 
just see this is the normal CTB file I didn't change anything it is the same like a cat CTB file exact I have to change here for changing click here edit for example this one is the red line I want to plot this red color line to another color so for this purpose click on red color and from the properties change the different color this color will be alternate color of the red color in the plotting so I am selecting the blue color save close for this line checking I have to click the preview even the line is red color but in the print preview it is showing the blue color and it will be plot like this exact hit on setting the magenta color I want to give alternative color to the magenta color I want to change this color to this color okay you guys can see the magenta color line is changed to the gray color exact bring back to the normal color apply we can change the line type from here also for example this color I want the red color to be blue and the line type should be dotted even it is continuous line so because I change the line type in the CTB file once we click the preview we can see the red color line is blue and dotted let me change the line type because it is not visible properly I am selecting this one short dashed x2 preview you guys can see even the color is red but it is showing blue and even the line is continue line but in the print it will be like this exact so we no need to change inside in the drawing we can change it from the plot style whatever we want to change we can change the next is the line width we can change as well for example I am selecting the 1 mm preview see this line is thicker than other lines line end and style its mean what kind of line end you want to apply on the line for example normal I am checking this one is the line end you guys can see it is like a arc exact for example I am selecting like this like a diamond preview see the end of the line is changed like a diamond bring back diamond also we can change the join also the screening what is the purpose of this screening for example this is 100 I am keeping one preview see it is it is not visible if I change the screening to to 40 preview you guys can see the line is a little bit more visible eighty it is a little bit more visible and this is the hundred percent 
this cleaning option is very useful once we are creating the contours or something like a much densed file we can change from here we can edit the width from here also edit 3 mm okay you guys can see one is changed to the three we can edit more also i have to keep one in this drawing i have these dimensions cyan color which is not look visible properly so i am changing the cyan color to the blue color save preview you guys can see the cyan color is changed to the blue color and i want to change this tree color also the tree color is 67 so i have to change the 67 color to the for example this color you guys can see the tree color is changed so like this we can create the ctb file and we can do changes inside in the ctb file now i am changing this ctb file to the monochrome add it bring back to the normal this one also all the things is normal for example click one color till end shift press the shift button and click and change it from here to black preview so you guys can see everything is black all the color are the same exact and if you check the monochrome apply preview it is also the same so like this we are creating the ctb file and we can do the changes in it in the next video i will create the stb file so hopefully guys this video will be helpful for you thanks for watching bye